Well, the elves came and brought us some lumber. This is the place where I have to go. Got the new refrigerator. Good morning, everyone. Have we got a busy day today? First thing we got to do is we've got to go here and pick up one of these and then I've got to deliver it to a rental property where the refrigerator has failed. Joys of being a rental property owner. And then uh, got to go pick up the big trailer, go down to uh, pick up some lumber Positive note price of lumber has come down about 25% or at least for dimensional lumber, so I've got a little bit of re reprieve on the price of uh, framing lumber the cost of OSB and plywood is still rather expensive But uh, well We'll deal with that when we get to that part but uh, at least I got a little reprieve on the dimensional lumber that's gonna save me a few hundred dollars on this next phase of the project and uh, we'll just move right along I'll take the winds where I can find them it'll help offset the cost of this refrigerator So let's go get Ray and let's get started. This is the place where I have to go. All right, and here we are. Got the new refrigerator for this house. You may remember this from my other video. This is the one that I bought uh, in 2016. So uh, anyway, so the refrigerator finally quit, so it's time to replace it. And there you have it, $700 worth of lumber. Well, I don't know if it's worth it, but it's $700 what it cost. Well, the elves came and brought us some lumber. <laughs> <laughs> the, the Home Depot elves, $700 worth. Yeah. Oh my goodness.
we put these two by fours on here for the top for the top board and this is what our new pitch is going to be on our roof but they're a little bit springy so what we're going to do in order to stiffen them up we're going to come in and we're going to put braces underneath the middle of all these so that you have no more than a six foot span on a two by four which would be plenty or the, the six foot span will be plenty to carry the load of the roof and uh, we'll cleat you know, all this pine straw and what have you out from in here before we close it up but uh, this is probably going to be the extent of what we do today it's uh it's after four o'clock and we've been going since eight this morning the refrigerator getting the lumber running back and forth uh, i'm tired so uh, we're going to call it a day and ray's pretty well got the all the trash cleaned up in the backyard so um, we were able to get a dumpster it's it's crazy uh, the price of lumber is out of out of this world uh, you can't get the dumpsters uh, two weeks since the last dump I was able to get another dumpster uh, I guess either construction is going crazy or um, you know everybody's doing you know, the, the, the home remodels or whatever I don't know but anyway uh, we're gonna come back probably tomorrow and do some blocking in our valleys build the cricket behind the porch uh, gable frame out those valleys and then cut, cut back our overhangs and build our uh, overhangs and we'll be ready for decking probably tomorrow we'll be ready for decking and then uh, hopefully soon we'll be getting some metal on this roof so that's where we're at right now and that is a wrap well we did manage to get a few things done today we got a refrigerator installed for a client one of the rental properties we got um, the roof overlay installed we got all the trash picked up just about in the backyard which that was a a big mess um still gonna have to put some braces on the roof so that it won't be bouncy uh this is a 12 foot span for a two by four uh it's a, still a little bit soft set 12 foot's a little bit much for a two by four even for yellow pine so we're going to be putting some blocking in for that we got to come back and we got to do blocking at their valleys build a cricket behind the ga uh, gable over the front porch uh, build the roof over the front porch cut back the overhangs and then we can put some osb on the roof but uh, that's going to be coming for an another day um Anyway, we're going to call it a day. I'm tired, and it's 5 o'clock. Who else loves this time change? Is this time change not awesome? It's like 5 o'clock, and it's almost dark. Oh, you got to love this. You know, of course, sarcasm, right? Um, I think, you know, just leave it alone. Just leave it alone. Anyway, that's all I got for today. Um, if you like the video, hit the thumbs up, hit the subscribe button, be notified, hit the bell, you know, notification for all. Uh, let's see what else. So uh, share this on your social media, tell your friends and family, and even the people you don't like, especially the people you don't like, because they'll be like, why in the world are you watching this guy? Anyway. Uh, until next time, we'll see you later.
Well, ooh, that's ugly. <laughs>